What's up guys, today we're eating smashed potatoes. You know, all this talk about potatoes has me thinking about the Irish War for Independence. In 1919, a small group of volunteers calling themselves the Irish Republican Army began bombing British police and military barracks, and sabotaged British intelligence sharing by robbing mail carriers and infiltrating agents into the police intelligence service. In 1920, they killed 176 police, recruitment to the constabulary dropped dramatically, and 2,000 men resigned. In 1969, the more militant wing of the IRA would break away, calling themselves the Provisional IRA, or Provost. They began a massive bombing campaign against the Protestant North, carrying out an average of four bombings a day. Their weapon of choice was the car bomb. As a response, the British would throw 4,000 Irish into internment camps. This culminated in the famous protests in 1972 where British troops killed 14, known as Bloody Sunday. By the signing of the Good Friday Agreements ending the Troubles in 1998, over 3,700 people would be killed in the fighting.